It's a fresco fiasco that simply won't be painted over. The National Hispanic Cultural Center Foundation owes the state nearly $150,000 of state, state tax dollars that it misspent. It's been a year and still no check. Now state leaders are getting antsy and the foundation's CEO is out. News 13's Alex Goldsmith has a story. It's an impressive work of art. A 4,000 square foot fresco mural on the grounds of the National Hispanic Cultural Center. Lawmakers paid out more than 800 grand to fund the massive mural. Money paid straight to the Cultural Center's foundation. But as News 13 investigative reporter Larry Barker uncovered last year, a good chunk of that money went into the foundation's pocket. DVDs, even a documentary. Not the mural. An audit found the foundation misspent about $285,000 of taxpayer money. Last April, former First Lady and Foundation CEO Clara Apodaca promised to pay the state back eventually. Any funds that the state identifies as being uh, inappropriate, right. will the foundation return every penny? Absolutely. But we'll have to raise it. You don't have the money. No. Nearly half of the money was paid back immediately. Since then, not a dime, meaning the foundation still owes the state 146 grand. They haven't uh, come up with definitive plans. It's been over a year now. Uh, we've written many demand letters to say, you know, you need to pay us back the money that you owe the state. Um, I don't know if they're having challenges in fundraising, but they really need to make that a priority. Now it looks like there will be a change in leadership. The foundation board's vice chair tells us Apodaca will step down from her job in November, citing family reasons. It's unclear when the foundation will pay the state its mural money, but the board says it is working on a plan. Alex Goldsmith, KRQE News 13. The board tells us they're waiting for receipts from their biggest fundraiser of the year to come in to see how quickly the foundation can pay the state back.